What's up, everybody? Disco Demonic Hydroponic. So, um, today, I know it's been a while. My phone was kind of fucked up for a while. Hopefully, I can record this whole video. I'm going to try to make it fast. Uh, I'm going to try to make my videos really short just to kind of be able to upload everything. And I'm talking too fucking much. So, right now, all right. So, uh, today, I was actually doing some meditations and I channeled a mantra and a sigil that you don't really need to use. I was actually told that um, I. This was kind of, this sigil was just something for me to acclimate the energies, but you can use this mantra that I'm about to give you, and it's for any kind of healing, whether you work in the light or you work in the dark or you work in both, uh, it will work for anybody. Um, so uh, that's what I was told, and it's actually every time I even say it, I get like this kind of a blue kyanite kind of feeling, the energy kind of flowing through me, which is really cool. So uh, I thought I'd share. I'm actually going to say the mantra. And I'm going to share the, the sigil that I got in case you're the type of person that likes to use sigils and acclimate to that or whatever. Right? So uh, here it is. I just drew it out. I'm not going to get all super fancy. So that's what it looks like. And that's the uh, mantra right there. And it's Emeketum Herbala Sanquiche. And the way I have it written is kind of like phonetic, basically how you would just say it. Um, <clears throat> the H is kind of silent. Uh, you would pronounce almost like if you're thinking about like half of the H in a way. Uh, so instead of like the H, huh, he make it them, you'd be like, eh, make it them. You know what I'm saying? So kind of like E, however you want to fucking rationalize that or think about it in your fucking brain, that's cool. So, anyways, eh, make it herbala sanquiche. Again, you can use this even in ritual. Uh, I was told that you can use this in ritual, like you can uh, add it to any healing ritual that you're doing on yourself or on somebody else. Use this mantra in order to like convey that this is a, a healing space. Uh, this this space is like to bring in energy, healing energies, and um, just to kind of like you know, that's what you're doing in, in in the in the space that you're creating to like whatever the ritual is. You know, it's kind of hard. I don't know exactly what ritual you would use it for, but uh, that's what it is. If you do like any kind of reiki or any other type of energy healing, uh, you can use it for that. So. Uh, it's pretty universal, man. So uh, I would say give it a shot. See what you think. Um, and uh, yeah. So I'll actually add this in the description below. Also, uh, I did write a uh, my first like short book like on how to meditate. It's basically the same as the video that I made. And I actually added the link in the video. But some people like to read as opposed to watch videos. So I'm going to add that in the link in the description below. A link to the book that I uh, uploaded on Kindle. It's really cheap. It's like if you have a Kindle Limited, it's free. If uh, you don't, it's like $2.99. Uh, but it's a really quick read, easy kind of reference points. Uh, but it's basically like the same thing as the video. So if you just watch the video, that's cool. If not, you want something to have kind of like to check out later, you can do that too. So uh, thanks for watching. Uh, if you like the video, share with your friends. If you hate it, share with your enemies. Uh, have a good day, night, whatever.